بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم قول انفو فوجو جرن پا خوش آمدید آج ایک اور سیکلوجیکل ڈسٹربنس کے ساتھ حاضر ہیں یہ معلومات آپ کو آپ کے زندگی کو بہتر بنانے کے لیے پیش کی جاتی ہیں The today's topic is 8 reasons why you are not sleeping well. Are you tired of waking up more tired than when you went to bed? Does it seem like a good night's sleep? is more elusive than your half-remembered dreams. If you have been having a tough time falling or staying asleep, chances or cause is either something you are doing or something you are not doing. If one of these common causes of not sleeping well applies to you, you may be able to address it. <coughs> the first thing, nighttime exercise. People do nighttime exercise, leaving after work. A casual round the block stroll with your dog before his bedtime is fine, but a heart pumping, sweat dripping cardio workout without three hours of your own bedtime is too much. Your body temperature and heart rate naturally drops as you feel asleep. <coughs> Exercise raises those two body functions and stimulates your entire nervous system, making it tough to snooze. Solution The Fix Schedule your workout for the morning or hit the gym on your lunch hours. Number 2 Alcohol before bedtime. <coughs> a single glass of wine can be a forerunner to romance, and romance itself is one of the best preloads to sleep. But indulge in much more alcohol before bedtime and you will probably find that your sleep is impaired. The initial effect of alcohol is relaxation. So you will probably drop off to sleep quickly after imbibing. But alcohol interferes with your sleep cycle especially the REM sleep that includes dreaming. The result is fragmented, unrefreshing rest, plus you are likely to wake up needing to use the bathroom during the night, a definite hit to your sleep quality. Solution The limit alcohol use, especially in the evening hours. The third thing is the room temperature was most sleep experts recommend keeping your bedroom at a moderate 65 to 72 degrees at night but many people like to cut energy costs by turning the 
thermostat down to the freeze zone during the winter. The switching the AC off during the summer leading to a sweltering bathroom. Both of these extremes hijack your trip to land of the north. However, your body needs to cool slightly at night for the most refreshing sleep, which is impossible in an overly heated bedroom. A too cold room, on the other hand, will wake you up. Solution If you don't want to adjust the thermostat, wear thick socks to a well blanketed bed during cold stamps and use a fan in the summer. Number four comes stress and worry. Probably the most common non medical reasons for the short term insomnia. Is a mind filled with worries or stresses? During the day, the activities of life tend to distract you, but once you settle yourself into bed, your mind is free to roam. For most people, it's not the good aspects of their lives that their mind chooses to focus on, but rather the negatives. Try to fix it. You can combat this in several ways. Write down your worries about bedtime, before bedtime, along with a few things you are grateful for. It's really start to fret. Get out of bed without turning on any light and go sit in another dark room. This can break the worry cycle and calm your mind quickly enough to return to the bed. And... Uh, Try a daily mediation practice. You don't need to be an expert yoga or yogi or spend hours sitting on a mat. Even 10 minutes a day is a beneficial for you. Number 5. Late Afternoon Caffeine You know a bad cup Bedtime cup of coffee is bad idea, but did you know that the half life of a caffeine is there? Is three to five hours. That means only half the dose is eliminated during that time, leaving the remaining half to linger in your body. That's why a late afternoon cup of a jar can disturb your sleep later that night. How you can fix this? Although caffeine's effect on your dependent depend on your tolerance, the dose, and your age, it is best to keep your consumption below 400 mg per day and stay away from caffeine sources after lunch time. Number six, sharing your bed. Sharing your bed with a partner, whether human or four-legged, greatly reduces the quality of your sleep. If your partner snores, crowds you, hugs the curves, or otherwise makes you uncomfortable, while you're probably not going to banish your spouse from the bedroom, although a surprisingly high percentage of married couples do sleep in separate rooms, you do need to catch some shut eye how you can fix this solution give mittens and fido beds of their own and encourage your snoring partner to sleep on their side not on their back use a white noise machine to block out the sounds of soft snoring or try earplugs if the decibel level reaches a corsado Number seven, too much light. Whether it's coming from your bed partner's reading lamp 
the television or outside your window, light exposure at bedtime impairs your quality of sleep. For some people, even the glow of a bedside alarm clock is enough to signal their brain that it's time to wake up. How you can fix this? Turn off electronics at least one hour before bedtime. If lights from an outside source shines into your bedroom and cannot eliminate it, hang blackout shades or curtains. This is especially important if you work nights and need to sleep. This is especially important if you work nights and need to sleep during the day. Close your bedroom door to shut up out light from other areas of the house. For the simplest solution, known as satanity sleep, mask before closing your eyes. And last is the wrong snake. In your typical bedtime snake, a slice or two of pizza or a bag of chips. If so, don't be surprised when you are lying awake starting at your ceiling. A full, a full load of fat or protein right before bedtime sends your digestive system into overdrive, making it difficult to sleep and potentially giving you heartburn. But hunger pain but hunger pains can wake you up as well as can precipitous blood sugar drops during the night. How you can fix this? Have a small snack before hitting the day. It should be heavier on complex carbs, lighter on proteins, but Including both, good choices include a small bowl of whole grains, cereal and milk, a slice of daily turkey wrapped around a celery stick, or a piece of fruit separate with peanut butter. Thank you very much. These were some bad habits in which sleep disturbed and you cannot get sound sleep keep watching goal info for you for more latest healthy psychological things office